Hey guys, welcome to my channel Hammond's Hobby. So today we're gonna to be opening up the last box of this F1 Dynasty case. We've already had three quite good hits, so what's gonna be in the last one? Stay tuned to find out. So before we get into it, I just want to say a huge thank you to everyone as always. Smash up the like button, click subscribe. Follow me on my Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, uh, all of all that stuff under the name Hammond's Hobbies. I'm getting a bit tongue-tied here. So we have the last box from this case. So, so, so far from the hits that we've had from the case, one of them's already been sent off and delivered to the person that won it on a box break. That was Toto Wolf. We've also had Lando Norris, one of five. We've also had George Russell, which is a one of 10. And now we've had Nicholas Latifi, uh, the gold one of one. What's in this last box? I have no idea. I'm gonna assume it's a team principal because I've had three good drivers on the bounce. I say it's three good drivers. <laughs> I think Latifi's probably the weaker card to hit. Um, but let's find out. Smash up that like button for some positive vibes. Love to hear your thoughts. What do you think of this F1 Dynasty set? This is the last, last one from the case. Let's have a little look. What have we got in this one? Big pressure time. All right, let's have a little look what we can see here. So we have got, it's a, it's a silver. It's a silver, so it's a one of ten. But it looks like a jumbo patch. What color is that? It's green, so I assume this is going to be either Sebastian Vettel or Lance Stroll, or it could be their team principal. It could be who'd that be? That'd be Otmar, I think, at this point. Um, but let's find out. I'm hoping for Vettel. <laughs> I would rather Vettel than Lance Stroll. Otherwise, we've had both the Canadians pulled. Let's have a little look. Well, it looks like that person's wearing a cap. I think this is Vettel. Sebastian Vettel, it is! Sebastian Vettel with the jumbo patch. Five out of 10, look at that, beautiful. That looks awesome. Congratulations, you have pulled an F1 Dynasty autograph patch card from 2021. Nice, nice, well happy with that. Sebastian Vettel's a very popular driver amongst the fans, so uh, yeah, that's a real good selection there. We have got Lance, uh, Lando Norris, uh, George Russell, that's a glove card. Um, we've got the Nicholas Latifi in gold, and now we've had the jumbo patch, Sebastian Vettel. So, whoo, big, big hits there. What do you guys think? Comment down below. We've got the two British guys at the top. Obviously, coming from Britain myself, you know, I have a, a bit of a bias towards them. But uh, I think we can all agree, these are beautiful, beautiful cards. I love the fact that they've added colour into this year. I love the way the autograph just pops on the page. Um, obviously, I much prefer this gold, not just because it's a one of one, but I actually just really like gold cards. I like gold, uh, even the penny sleeves I use are gold. So, but I don't think I'll be putting uh, any of these cards in gold penny sleeves anytime soon. Um, but what do you guys think? Should I send these all off to be graded or should I just sell them raw? I'd love to hear your thoughts. It's a tough one. It is a tough one. I, In terms of what they're worth, I have no idea. Whenever I talk to people about F1 Dynasty, people just go off on a, you know, oh, it's worth 25 grand, and then someone will say, no, it's worth three grand. So it's like, you know, it's really hard. The last one was Lando. His comps for this type of card was five and a half grand, 18 and a half grand, and then like four, five grand. This was all in dollars. So I was like, how's that even possible? How's there such a massive discrepancy between them? But yeah, I think I've actually sold this one now to a gentleman in America. He's paid uh, 3,000 pounds for it. Um, so yeah, 
congratulations to that guy. I thought it'd be worth between three and 4K. I'm not sure what this one is worth, the George Russell. I have absolutely no idea. Uh, I have no idea on these either. I'm going to assume Natifi's worth 750 maybe a grand, and Vettel, I don't know. I honestly don't know. I'd be just plucking a figure out of thin air. Maybe 1,500, 2,000, something like that. I don't know. <laughs> I'd love to hear your thoughts. Uh, comment down below. That's it from me, guys. I hope you've enjoyed that. It's probably the last F1 Dynasty that I'm going to do for a little while. I've got another case of them, but I'm going to keep that sealed for a little bit, I believe, unless I really, really get itchy. Now, I shouldn't have opened these all up tonight, but I did because I just can't help myself. <laughs> That's it from me, guys. I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.